Disclaimer. The subject matter has been produced using AI technology and can in no way be employed as fact. The AI works on articles and blogs, so it may only be deemed as what others believe, not necessarily the editor of this video. This video is in no way intended as fact or intended to cause undue stress, only for entertainment value. The disclaimer is produced by Tony of Tony's Music. Thank you. What is the difference between a lie and a white lie? The dictionary defines a lie as a false statement made with intent to deceive, but what about a white lie? Is that also a form of lying? A white lie is a statement made without any intent to deceive. It is an exaggeration or a distortion of the truth. For example, if you are asked by your boss why you did not turn up for work this morning and you tell him that you were late because you had a flat tire, you have just told a white lie. You may be lying, but you are not intentionally deceiving anyone. So why do we say that some lies are white lies? Because sometimes it is hard to distinguish between a lie and a white lies. Sometimes it is difficult to determine whether someone is telling the truth or not. It is important to remember that when you are dealing with people who are telling lies, it is very easy to get caught up in their stories. It is very easy to lose track of time and to forget that you have other things to do. If you find yourself getting drawn into a conversation with a liar, it is important to take note of how long it has been going on. It is important to make sure that you are not spending too much time talking to someone who is lying to you. If you are being lied to, you need to stop talking to them. You need to stop wasting your time. When you are faced with a liar, you need to think quickly. You need to think of something to say to stop the conversation. If you cannot think of anything to say, then you should walk away from the person. You need to think of something that will allow you to end the conversation. Do not be afraid to walk away from a conversation with a liar. If you are too nice, they will use you to try and manipulate you. If you are too aggressive, they will use you to intimidate you. They will use you to try and control you. When you walk away from a conversation with someone who is trying to lie to you, you need to focus on something else. You need to make sure that you do not dwell on the fact that you are no longer talking to them. You need not worry about them. Focus on something else. Focus on something that will allow you to forget about the conversation that you have just had.